Poppy Playtime Chapter 4. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that, I'm not gonna lie. I've seen the updates so far and we're like, uh. Also, aren't you supposed to like turn those things around? You normally know, 4 out of 22, not 22 out of 4. Hello? Are you watching me? Okay. Oh no, the shadow man is gone, but I already noticed, but didn't do anything. You know. But yeah, like, I mean, I can do more with content creation too. Like, for example, now Project Elise one as I said. Edit videos more. I've been waiting like one minute. Does your girlfriend live, live, live behind the fork in the forest or something? Now the boat is gonna be destroyed, you know, and from the ice the end. That's how this game goes. But like, I project at least one of them, like, wanted to make 18 outfits, 18 outfits for each Pokemon type one. Oh, yeah. I saw something just now. Everything seems calm. Among the faces, you notice something. You pick it up and re-enter the house. Take it. Nadine is waiting. What is happening, Nadine? An enemy defeated. You're in seven fragments and one lunar fragment. You're in a blood and bow. This, this, this is gonna be a long, long, long video. And I'm not kidding, I didn't think game one would be that long, you know. I mean, you know, I'm not gonna lie. So, uh, you know, I'm not gonna talk, you know, I'm pregnant and, you know, work show, you know, and that sort of stuff, uh, you know. Because y'all know I'm a pregnant polyphetic trans girl, and I all know we're here for horror. So uh, let's talk and let's start. Our first game of today is called Ferry. Yeah, Ferry. You know, you know the ferry man that takes you on a boat across the river. Yeah, that that's a horror game about a ferry man. Oh, well, like I even yeah, like already can hear you thinking, Elias. You know how can a ferry man drop be, you know, scary? Well, uh, some people have fear of water. You know, the loss of phobia, is the, that's what I, call, I think it's called. Don't quote me on that. Some people have fear of the water. But on the other hand, have you ever been on a boat that's in, stuck in a storm? Or with an upcoming storm? Or like that sort of stuff? Imagine a storm is coming, you're on a boat, and you have to evacuate people from like the island on the other side to your side, and then vice versa. Can we survive for every people? Everyone, can we rescue, you know, everyone that's uh, on the island and evacuate? Because the storm is coming. And if the storm is coming, the island won't be happy. The island requires a sacrifice. Uh, I'm going away too far. Well, that's our first game of the day. And that's our first holy game of the day. And also, uh, now that I think about it, I won't promise you that the, last, uh, that the same problem as last week happened. You know, where... Uh, did I upload my did I upload my YouTube video not to think about it? Where uh, I used the same clip twice. Uh, to explain that basically uh, to explain that I have like <laughs> I was like making uh, how do you call it? I was making like a behind the scenes idea on how I may uh, edit these videos and that sort of stuff. Oh I did release it. Oh. I did release it, so and uh, I've heard, I think thanks to that, that like I've not really been like, uh, yeah, whoa, 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 whoa. So uh, that should be fixed for this time, and it won't happen again, I promise. Uh, but our second game of the day is uh, a game called. Where is my Trisker game cheat sheet? Uh, don't live alone. And he'd be like, he'd be like, don't live alone has a lot of interpretations. Uh, but for this game, 
our protagonist lives on an island alone. And he's been writing, like he's a newspaper man, he's been writing like an article, which is half redacted, because hey, you know, that's how it goes, and that sort of stuff. <laughs> and uh, he goes to the city to, you know, hang on his newspapers, and it takes so long that he arrives at the city at night, and you'll be like, oh, what are you thinking? Oh, 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 oh. But like, yeah, what happens at night in the city? And what happens if you live alone on an island and you go to the city then? I don't know, you have to watch game number two to find out what happens number there. And game number three is a short introduction into a new horror roguelike game. And what do I mean with that? Uh, no Skin is a horror roguelike game, as the word said it. You're at a party and, you know, you think you, dr you drink too much, you drink too much alcohol and that sort of stuff. And you happen to cross into a world where a skinless man asks for his skin back. And if you don't have that skin, Oh, oh, and you face him, oh, 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 you will be in some trouble. Can you find this skin before your life reaches its end in this roguelike? Who knows? I don't know. Uh, Patreon members that I'm gonna show, or, well, no skin is your third roguelike horror game, so they, you know, if you wanna see that. As normal, if you wanna see any of the games, I will leave chapters linked uh, down in the video below, so you can, like, easy na easily navigate. If you only wanna see no skin, if you only wanna see fairy man and that sort of stuff. Uh, the Patreon members uh, that are shown now on screen, uh, thank you for being a Patreon member. Arigato for making me do this, you know, allow me to do this while earning a few bucks. If you want to join them on the Shadow Wall, make sure to check out the link tree at the bottom of the video description. Uh, all my socials will be in there. And while you're down there, subscribe and ring the notification bell and like the video. It really helps me out and it really helps to put out this video into the YouTube algorithm and that sort of stuff. You know, the your typical YouTuber stuff, but apparently people need to remind you to do it because otherwise people will forget it. And that sort of stuff. If you want to join them, as I said, link is in the link tree down below. There will be all my official socials. In case you use Discord, because, because I know not a lot of people use Discord. Uh, you can join my public Discord. It's also linked down there. It's the best place to stay up to date it. You know, and uh, talk to me. I do respond to, try to respond to every comment because, uh, well, you're my community. And if you want to say something to me, you know. That's also a way, in case you don't use Discord. Uh, but as I said, if you don't use Discord, subscribe, ring the notification bell, and keep an eye on the community tab on my Twitter or on Instagram for any updates and that sort of stuff. And with that, I'm going to say, I hope you have a wonderful time watching. Halloween is around the corner. And my tail, see you in game number one. Welcome to a new 3 scary game. So yeah, I start off in PUG form because, uh, you know, this game has been heavy. You really know what's funny? Uh, I'm not the, on this screen, and I know, let me fix that, uh, at existing, uh, I wanted to show this, basically, yeah, you know, the reason I wanted to show this is because, uh, I was, like, pretending to record, and I saw this chat active, uh, the chat that I normally use for stream element, because here, look, if I type, like, uh, this, see how I'm coming through this? Is this not on his channel, too? Or not because I was like I was like curious because I sometimes uh, see uh, basically well people talk in the chat and uh, since I see people talk in the chat sometimes I see it and I can see it and I thought you know where be glitched by stream elements but uh, you know the funny thing is for some reason for some Armed reason, this chat is also connected with Tim, the Tatman. This is Tim's Tatman, the Tatman live chat on Twitch at the moment, and that sort of stuff. This is his live chat, because I saw like uh, I saw someone's note like tag him, and I was like, okay, you know. You know, let's go there and see if it's chat. And I saw people oh, like back and forth, back and forth, and that sort of stuff. But uh, yeah, see this game Motar? That is like also in this chat. So like, I don't know why, but streamer elements apparently connected my chat to that. And yeah, I wanted to, I wanted to start with that. You know. Uh, I was looking through the job section when I found an ad for a ferryman. Apparently, the tennis cut the bias having a festival and a regular ferryman broke his leg. 
The offering a hefty bonus due to the show such short notice. The ferry goes to Switzerland, as famous was the camping spot, so they're pretty busy. There's still big easy money. I called the most on the road within an hour. I mean, like, you know, let's have a, like, a nice, easy boat ride. And that sort of stuff. You know, I'm gonna, not gonna lie, I need a new webcam. It's not because, like, I can't really show off, as you can see. But, uh, this thing, like, this thing, I swear it have is like, have its own will. Do I... Like, has its own will. I don't know why, but, like, if I turn this thing and, like, try to point it, like, at my belly and my keyboard, it is, like, tries to turn back, and it's, like, now nah, you, you put me like that, you know? The one filling in for me, my fairy likes all, uh, likely older than you. Okay. So sorry that I'm, like, 25 and you want to have a job. You know, sometimes I feel like, should I get a job, you know? That, well... You treat her right, important, do not wreck my boat or I'll feed you for to the fishes. I see you made it! Who's this? Why, well, I'm the owner of that uh, ferry, didn't you get my note? Oh yeah, nice to meet you. Just a peek out to my boat and I'll call it a pleasure after, you know? What? You need to do? Yeah, seems simple enough. Very well then, just press that button to raise the gate and let get a move on. You know, sorry that I'm 25 and tried to get a job. You know, even while pregnant. And that sort of stuff. Because, like, I'm not gonna lie, like, uh, sometimes it feels more... You know... How do you say that? More appealing to just, like, do pretend to, like, job search because I have, like, a job hunt. Policy. Or I need to do. Do I need to go to the car? Uh, do I need to let the people in? Okay, I come in already. Yeah, you know, but like, I get like enough loan to live on my own. Do I? What do I do? <laughs> okay, which moron? Hey, you! Next lane, please. Oh, I was like, hey, yo, you can ride on. Go ahead. Uh, how much, how much weight can I put on the thing? On you go. I can put one more car in there. Take the open lane. Why do you see this is a busy night? You're gonna tell me I need to have my work cut out for this? I never realize. Why is, that, is this the door like outside or? That's like a shove door. Yeah. But like, like I get like minimum wage for like doing nothing basically and that sort of stuff. Uh, do I need to check something? Uh, I thought it was the red of like there's too much weight on it. Is there too much weight on the thing? I listen to her engine, poor. She keep a steady purse as long as you hold the lever down. Do I, uh, you know how it's a boat ride, that can go wrong. But like, yeah, like I earn like basically minimum wage at the bare minimum uh, because of my failed job hunt and that sort of stuff. I've been making these trips for as long as I can remember. I've been telling the story here, sir. It's very quiet. As it should be. It's too quiet. I've been telling here a story and this guy's like, you know, I make a lot of trips with him. Yeah, I don't care. But, uh, 
like my job doesn't go that well and such stuff. So, uh, you know, I get minimum wage, the bare minimum, with like rent rental support. So, and no gate on the island, so just load any waiting cars and head back. Have a good night. And you can go. There safely. And uh so yeah, like sometimes it's just still appealing to not like job hunt anymore, you know what I mean? Like I sit on my ass and make content and create games, play games all day basically. Basically, you know, basically you have to love what a lot of people want. The store. Maybe. Oh, there's no... Oh. Is that all? That seems like all. But, like, you know, I've been, like, living the life that most people want. Like, I game all day, you know, I just sent a few job offers out there, and, like, if I get a job, yeah, so be it. Is there a storm coming? I'll give you that idea. A passenger mentioned it. Ah yes, just checked with Coast Guard and a freak storm is brewing out to sea. There was someone passing by. And yeah, like, like I do have, yeah, I, as I say, I do have, like, I am attended or required to, like, go job hunting and that sort of stuff. But, but you know, like, like my mother said, you know, you could just uh, apply for, like, director, you know, a director of a company. Yes, you don't get the job, but hey, you're job hunting, you know. But that won't work. I'm bored. I'm not gonna lie, I'm bored. So... Like, like, yeah, I wait, like, I go bed till, like, around, like, midnight, I wake up at, like, 10 a.m. normally, and then, like, yeah, well, I sit, like, do my content creation stuff, and that sort of, and that sort of stuff. Damn storm is really my weekend. You know? And after content creation stuff, it's like whatever I want to do, like groceries, or I'm gonna game, or gonna clean the house, and that sort of stuff. You know? Oh yeah, like, like, on the other hand, it's the ideal life. And such stuff. But on the other hand, now I'm not like pregnant, so you can say that I'm allowed to. But yeah, like I mean, I like I'm really complete. Like it was a fun thing. Like uh, I had like uh, a job, huh? like interview, and after that, like I wasn't selected for the second interview round. But they told me uh, it was a hard choice because like. I was very, like, very social, more so average social than the per uh, persons of my life or age. You know, you normally tell a five-year-old or a kid like this, you're more social than the rest of the class. So I like it so far. I'm trying to tell a story. Shut up. I could get used to this. Oh, don't you do have any questions for me? Tell me about the festival. Legend has it that there was a fishing village here once. One night the village was destroyed and the survivors built the current town. That was 200 years ago, to the night. Well, impressive. So far it's the, town, so it's the town's birthday. More like a memorial to the old village. Sure, life is full of hazards and we shouldn't forget that. Yes, yeah, a point. Living at sea is like full of hazards. So, 
Uh, but yeah, you know, you know, tell a kid that like, you're, oh, you're very social, you're more creative than the rest and that sort of stuff. Yeah, he told me that, I'm 25. <laughs> and I thought like, I told my mother that and my friends and they were all like laughing like, Elise, you, social? <laughs> it was a joke, it was like a joke, I was like, nope. Uh. And, uh, like, so, like, you know, he, like, the third thing is, like, he asked for technical question during the first round, which was, like, uh, you know, may you be blessed, you know, which I didn't notice, so, okay, fair, you know, I didn't show any technical knowledge, like, which is a fair point, and they noticed that, like, uh, like, taking juniors, uh, junior software developers and like, uh, these campers aren't happy about evacuation order. Where are those people then? Uh, no. Like, but those, uh, that it was hard to like, hire juniors, like educate them and like get them in line. And that sort of stuff. So, is that all? Seems to be all. And, uh, that's the reason they didn't hire me. I was like, oh, you know, said I couldn't try. But, like, like, yeah, I don't find, I, like, I know I'm an introvert and that I need my recharge time after, like, I had, like, my thing with friends or that sort of stuff. But, so, me, social, I was, like, surprised. <laughs> hey, watch it. I heard that all the way over here. Okay, I didn't hit anything. You have no pull for that. But, uh, yeah. So, like, yeah, your point has been a bit, going a bit rough. And, yeah, you can say it's my transgender side, which might make companies think twice. But no company is going to say that, because if they do that, they're, like, discriminating on, like, sexual or, how do you say it, that on your gender, you know, they're discriminating, which is against, the, like, uh, the law of the country where I live, so... Like discrimination based on race, gender, and that sort of stuff, you know? Uh, like, I start to feel like it's maybe a thing. Who knows? It might be not. Like, software related, I know that's my knowledge. You know, like, at this point, and sometimes I know it's like that I don't have a driver's license, okay? But I've been 10 years at school. Just to work at like a warehouse. Uh. Oh, like, look, there's a family, even. If there's a storm coming, why do I take people still on the ferry? Like, isn't that the one rule not to do? But yeah, like, uh... Yeah, that's why, I mean, that's why I still make the joke like, sometimes in videos, like, Oh, I take you to my new job, and that sort of stuff. You know? Because uh, I don't have a job yet. You're technically the same, right? Content creation is a job, and especially now that like I do stuff like make take it more serious. Like met editing videos more, you know, and that sort of stuff. And for example Project Elise Mon, you know, that sort of stuff, but uh I think it's still a hobby. Like if it was a job, I would make enough with my content creation to survive, you know, to make a living. And, like, I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't think I will ever make a living with content creation. I might, ma might make a lot of bucks with content creation in the future, if I'm big. You know, in content creation numbers wise, not in this size, because uh, that will come. <laughs> but, yeah, even if I'm big, like, like the thing is with content creation, for example, if you're a Twitch streamer and you only rely on, like, subscribers. A subscriber is like five bucks, and a subscriber can stop next month. So if I want to like sustain myself and have some money to spare, I roughly like if I would have like the same money. Don't worry, it's nothing complicated like a fuse box or anything. Just head below and you'll find the valve. Turn it and she'll be right as rain.
Set the valve. That should be the valve. What? Who's on king? I'll throw you out in the water if you don't watch out. Uh, but like, yeah, if I would have made uh, roughly the same amount of money like that I get now from government support, I will need roughly 300 subscribers for each month, huh? Because like, I, I roughly need some like 1500 bucks a month. I'll get now. So I need 300 subscribers per month. If like, like that's the thing with like Twitch subscribers and YouTube. If like one month you can have like 600 subscribers, the next month you can have like 200. Which makes 800 over two months, which will be 200 plus extra, you know? Or roughly 200 plus extra subscribers for uh, the two months. Your service to the town will not be forgotten. Okay. Yeah, you're gonna throw me overboard over my own boat. Uh, yeah. That's life. Like, like that's what I think. Like, if I need 300 subscribers a month, and like, I get one month 600, the next month 500, and then uh, two months after that only 100, then I have four months with like roughly 1,300 subscribers, which is like barely enough. You see what I'm getting? Like, if I need 300 subscribers and I get this month 300 and the next month 100, I will have not an or not enough income for that month. I suck stuff. So I would like I, I, like that's why most streamers and content creators have like still a side job, maybe, and that sort of stuff. So, but yeah. Or you're me, or you're like living off government funds and sit in your room, play on games all day. Oh, well, goodbye, village. Tsunami thinks that would also make sense. Gets thinks it was revenge. Revenge? Yeah, sailors came to the town with their stories and their kids eat them up. Kids always talk about ghosts and goblins. Hey look kid, these freak storms are no joke and there are more people to evacuate. Let's focus on that and we can talk tales after everyone's safe, okay? Now, I want to hear tales. And this game is 20 minutes already. Okay, in my offense, I've been like the first two minutes talk about, uh, you know, DM, the DM man's chat, in my chat, but. I still don't get that, though. like, the, why, why, is my, why is his chat coupled to mine element? It's from stream element. Like, at least now I know uh, where all those ch chatters come from. For the banquet. I wonder what happens if you like do one of the back first. Do it craft it to the others. Uh. No new people. Does that mean I go to the other side? Oh, there's people coming. I was expecting more horror to be honest. I'm not gonna lie. And now I've been chip chapping about work for the last 20 minutes. I've never been chip chapping about working for the last 20 minutes. <laughs> you know, I saw, like, I legit saw this game and it was like a short horror game. Why is short horror game now in the 20 minutes? And I may have been here chip chapping for the last 20 minutes about, like, TM Martin, TM Tim in my chat, stream element in my thing, and. Like, well, work, work life. But like, yeah, content creation wise, since I don't have a job, I can do more stuff. I've been doing another uh, 
shiny cards, you know, or Pokemon cards choose my shiny hunts video. Watch it. I did, didn't hit anything. You know, and like, I've done the first hunt. I listen, kid. There's probably be the last trip back, so I'm off to bed. You did good tonight, and I appreciate it more than you ever know. You know, how he's been doing fine the whole storm. You know, the last hit back doesn't get like that bad, you know. And that sort of stuff. But, uh. Back to heaven is clear, even for you. Ah, oh, thank you. I know. Like, please don't leave yet. My girlfriend called and asked me to get her. Okay, I'll keep a spot open. You have to hurry up. With that patience, I'm gonna, I ain't gonna wait. Next lane, please. Does that mean there are four people coming now? Oh yeah, I forgot. The evacuation is nearly complete. That's three spots, right? So I should wait on him. Is that him? But yeah, like, I mean, I can do more with content creation too. Like, for example, now Project Elise one as I said. Edit videos more. I've been waiting like one minute. Does your girlfriend live, live, live behind the fork in the forest or something? <laughs> now the boat is gonna be destroyed, you know, and everyone dies at the end. That's how this game goes. But like, yeah, Project Elise one, I feel like wanted to make 18 outfits, 18 outfits for each Pokemon type one. Oh, yeah. I saw something just now. Are we? Uh... Like for each Pokemon type, I want to make one outfit. I've made already one for normal type, and the next one I'm gonna work on is water type. But like I, I had fun with making the normal type, and I'm gonna have fun with making the water type. I think. But like the thing comes that like I have trouble choosing Pokemon for the other types, or at least the idea. But it's like that thing in the distance. Is that the light? Is that heaven? That? Katma? I, I also didn't know this game was this long. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, this is the street light. This was the last ride, right? Oh wait, my bad. My bad, I'm a bad fairy man. Or fairy woman. Uh. Wait, I have to go one more time? There was the last one, right? What? I don't know, I'm, go I'm going home. Fine. Everyone's been evacuated. There is one casualty this night. We must deliver the body. Okay, but let's make it fast. Agreed. Uh. 
And I was like thinking, the horror game this, you know. This an horror game, nah. You know, the clock is gone, so. Like, I honestly thought this was a short game. I'm not gonna lie. That's why I played it as first. And now the third game that I wanted to play today is gonna be a bit less, but... Like, and I also said I was expecting more war, to be honest. Because I was interesting. How can a fairy boat... Like, I was interesting, like, how to, like, you know, I saw the idea of, like, a ferry boat, you know. I saw something in the water. Did you saw that? Or was that the hawk? <laughs> like, I was thinking, just thinking, like, the idea of, like, a ferry boat, like, That night the creature known only to the people of Scotter Bay awoke and consumed the town's peace offering. Satisfied in exchange, the beast settled back down and ventures was averted for another century. The next morning the ferryman returned to the duty in the boat identical to the one sacrificed and went about business as usual. People once again flocked to the island getaway, never knowing that the beast sometimes mentioned in hushed whispers by the town folk was sleeping in plain sight. Well... Oh, no, I'm not gonna lie, I had fun. So. <laughs> like I said, I thought it was a horror game. Like a little bit more horror, you know? Mm. You know, a little bit more of peak, like, let the beast speak more when you're like at, at this side of the pier. Like, like, show the beast a bit more. Show, like, let, like, let the people tell about, like, the fantasy and the tales. Because, like, I know it's like a fairy man and you go back and forth and that's it, but like, you start talking about tales, you know, fantasy and tales and be like, nah, let's do the rescues, rescues first, you know? I want the tales, I want the horror, let me read the horror stories that make me shiver down my spine. Uh, but this was the fairy man, uh, this was game number one, if you want to play it for yourself, as you know, link is at the top of the video description. Uh, 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 alongside any of the other games and might I all see you in game number two. You know, I start to wonder if I chose the wrong horror games. Like, I... <laughs> like, I started to like... Like, I start to wonder if I chose the wrong... Top game stacked horror. You know what I've also been like, which I discovered today, you know, I have been using Notion to keep track of video ideas for horror games that I want to play. Uh, I think I better... It looks like it's a beautiful day. I'm going to take the newspaper and then I'm going to distribute them in the city. No wonder it's going to take me so long to travel in the hot air balloon. This guy apparently lives on an island because he was like dumb in society. But he's still a news reporter. Okay, you're telling me like you take twelve hours to go with your hot air, but okay. And if I don't do that, huh? I'm tired of writing this, I have to hurry up and post it. Why is this like a reducted paper full of like black things? Like a politics paper? Do I uh, take the other one? No. Uh, but I, I think I deleted by accident my, uh, my part of that video list. 
you know, because uh, I opened Notion today because I wanted to like note the Bind of Isaac video idea, and the whole table was gone. So. Shouldn't I take my lamp? Oh, uh, of course. Wait, is, is that? Okay, this is game like. Oh no. Like, I'm curious, is that the Palestina flag? Because I know without the white stars, the Palestina flag, but I think it's another country, if I remember correctly. Uh, but like, I like I wanted to note, like to get back to my notion story, because like, uh, I don't want to get into politics stuff and that sort of stuff. I leave out that to other people to discuss, or I'll keep that out of it. I must hurry and travel before night time. But like, uh, how do I? You know, this is life, like living on an island and be like, fuck society, and if I think about it, <laughs> fuck society, I'm gonna live on my own. Uh, but like, I opened Notion, I wanted to write that Binding of Isaac thing, and I saw my whole table, but I was like, oh. Like, there were genuinely, there were horror games on that list that I wanted to play, but like, due to like, escape the back rooms, I don't know the clock again, but Series and that sort of stuff, you know, uh, and Poppy Playtime. I didn't have a chance to play them yet, and you know that list was handy in case I wanted to start a new series because my Ace around the clock beginning of the series true, and yeah, I can like. Now that I think about it, if I want to play other horror games, I either need to upload them on Saturday or Sunday, or well, I. You know, I need to like replace them with these scary games because, uh, how do you say that? Unfortunately, it was nighttime fall when I arrived in the city. But that is a good thing that I brought a lamp. I didn't. L don't lie to me. Uh, but like now, uh, how do you call it? That's not my neighbor came with an update. The two new modes with the endless mode and the campaign mode. So I want to record that. Probably that's gonna take a few videos after all around the clock beginning bottom is on and that's from completely uploaded. Uh, you know, we're already in February. So then probably, you know, around the clock beginning or uh, uh, that's not my neighbor comes and that sort of stuff. And around that time when like that starts, it's like a Slenderman tip. Is this like a Slenderman type horror game? But like when around that time, all, all that, like what I want to say, when, I, uh, when around the time, around the clock beginning bottom is like completely uploaded, like January, February. And uh, you know what around that time comes? Poppy Playtime Chapter 4. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that, I'm not gonna lie. I've seen the updates so far and be like, uh. Also, aren't you supposed to like turn those things around? You normally 4 out of 22, not 22 out of 4. Hello? Are you watching me? Okay. What? Oh no, the Shadow Man is gone, but I already noticed, but didn't do anything. You know? Uh, so like, I'm looking forward to that, but like, I also know Amanda the Adventure uh, 2 is planned to release this at them. Is that out already actually? I don't think about it. Is that out already? Wait, I haven't seen any like YouTube videos. So is that out? And uh, no, I have I feel like I'm a wish list. 
it gets awfully lonely. Oh, tell me if I release it for 2024. Oh yeah. uh, no, not the red paint on the street, you know? The white paint was up, was like uh, gone for like the liquid. That truck looks awfully weird from like the side. Oh, I can't run. <laughs> but you're like, I don't know, Amanda the Adventure 2 is supposed to be come out. I actually also expect Escape the Back Rooms to come out somewhere this either. Nah, uh, Escape the Back Rooms might be. But I also expect Escape the Back Rooms to come out with an update uh, somewhere in that time area. And, uh, you know, I also expect Garden of Ben Ben. Oh, hello. Am I checking this thing? Don't stop. You know, guys, don't stop. <laughs> oh, oh, oh no, guys, it's the body. Oh no, stop. I'm gonna get jump scared now, I know it's already. Like, I also expect, like, Escape the Deck to come with an update soon. And Garno Ben Ben. You know? Like, I wanna be. How am I supposed to get there then? Okay. Like, I'm not supposed to be, like, surprised if Garden of Batman comes with an update. This, like, this Atom Winter. Oh no, it's the Shadow if you make it again. Oh. Hello. Oh, yeah, you've been colored in this time. Hello, sir. How's life? I'm turning around and he's like, jump scare me. Watch it. Boo. Oh, no. Are you the one that put the guy in, the, in like... Are you the one that put the guy, like, in the trash? Should I be worried about you? I guess. Hi, sir. Or is it like that I have to like hang up 22 out of 8, 22 papers? Yeah, I, I, I like I'm not surprised if like Garden... Like I'm not surprised if Garden of Batman 8 comes out like this at them. Oh no, the staring man is gone. Oh no. Oh. Hey. Oh. It's a pretty tight gap. It's a pretty tight top. So I'm not surprised, like I said. I think, like, the Atom Winter Space is gonna be, like, a lot of horror. I'm busy at work. Yeah, I totally agree with that. Final paper, I turn it on and I get killed. This is how this game ends. You're not believing me? I went from the place immediately. You know, this is like a dead end. But I'm running already. Back, don't worry, nothing's gonna happen. He's not waiting at my weather balloon, you know. He's not waiting at my weather balloon, don't worry, you know, guys. I'm safe, I can't run with my pregnant body.
When I succeeded in escaping this creature, I reached home and it was morning. I should take a nap. Watch the creature be, you know, join me on the door. <laughs> it's not my other balloon. Watch it get jump scared. Boo! Nah, I, I got you, huh? I got you. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> What's up the deer? Oh, that's the purpose of the deer. Hey, there is a skeleton in my... A smoking skeleton. I know, I know Halloween is coming up, guys, but, uh... It does make me the joke, you know, when when the skeleton, you know, when the corpse, is, like when when the body is still hanging in your neighbor's tree after Halloween, like, huh? I'm gonna honestly thought the city was it, you know. Ah, uh, what a surprise the deer is that. Oh my God, it seems he has arrived here. I must hide immediately. How do I hide? I'm gonna hide in my house. Okay, I didn't know he was behind me. Oh, I need to pee all of a sudden. I want to test one thing because where was the what a balloon? It was there? I now I now need to like put like you know. Ah. Uh, oh, it works. When I flooded the place, I found that being away from people was terrifying and it made me nervous and hallucinating. From now on, I will not move to a place where I live alone. Rather, I will live with people. 
and forget about living alone because this makes me feel lonely and I have terrifying hallucinations. Thank god that this creature I saw was not able to catch me. I don't know if this is a real being or if I am hallucinating but eventually I will leave my island completely and never return. It was like the game page said something about the mic but uh, I think this is a nice lesson but like you know like I think this is a real nice lesson that like even if sometimes like an island out in the ocean with like nobody on there like away from society seems ideal I think we humans need social interaction and without like social interaction you're gonna do weird stuff and that sort of stuff I'm not surprised I'm like crazy yet uh. but yeah I think this is a lesson like if you see someone in loneliness go say hi to them invite them to something they you think they will like like it's just a gesture that helps 9 out of 10 time and that sort of stuff and for the part, this game was like, <laughs> like my, o my only complaint, my only complaint in the city part, like in the city part were two things. Oh, it closes itself. Okay. Uh, in the city part was like two things, you know, uh, that counter, I think it's supposed to be around, you know, from like eight from 22. And you know, you have like, sh like if you see that shadow you see or that person on the street, if you get too close, let them jump scare you. I think if you do that, that you catch a lot of people off guard and you get more scared. I believe that because if I walk up to him and get jump scared, I'll be thinking twice about crossing that street. I want to cross that street as far as possible. Uh, but that was game number two. I don't live alone. Uh, if you want to play it for yourself, I said link is in the top of the video description. And with that, I'm going to say I hope on to the final game of today's episode. Uh, welcome to No Skin. No Skin is a full-fledged, uh, actually, rogue-like horror game. And uh, if you want to see a full series playthrough on this, let me know in the comments down below. And I'm happy to do it. I'm like going to play for like 15 to 20 minutes. Because, uh, oh, you can do full screen. Oh, then I don't, don't need this, right? Uh, remove. But like, uh, you know, uh, you know how I've been like playing the Binding of Isaac a lot and that sort of stuff. So uh, I thought, you know, why not do like a bit of, I think this, what has this been throughout my, wait. Welcome to a new three scary game. So yeah, I started. Uh, why do I now notice this? <laughs> Uh, I've been recording by the vice, I kept Project Diva, so that's my disc controller, but I've been now noticing that that's behind my hand cam. Uh, and that sort of stuff. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I play a lot of Binding of Isaac recently, so I've been into rogue genres a lot. And uh, I've been getting pretty decent at Binding of Isaac, even if it with mods and that sort of stuff. But uh, I thought, you know, since, since Halloween is around the corner, why don't I do a rogue like, with like this focus more on horror teams? That sort of stuff. So I will play this for like 15 to 20 minutes and then we'll call it a day. So because this video is also going to be way, way too long. In case many of us like a single turn and then select an action. Flushing enemies HP show how much damage you will deal when the select a weapon item. Mm, oh wait, I don't have ammo. Oh. Ow. How much HP do I have? Is that on the left? Noir. Noir. You didn't fall asleep, did you? Oh, I thought something made me drink too much. Noir, I hope you're okay. I want to talk to you about something important later. And by the way, Esther, you messed up. Did you really think I would find out? 
Me? What are you talking about? I bought Monica. I didn't know her anything. I didn't know what she found out. Sure, whatever. I know exactly how. Hey, Rex, enough. She said it's not her fault. Why know where I didn't go yesterday? Let's forget about it. I clocked out at a 14 hour shift. And a bitch told me she didn't like how I worked. Next time, maybe give me a human friendly shift. What do you think? <laughs> maybe I was better if I had stayed quiet. I'm not feeling very well. Esther, come here and give me a kiss. And we lost Trish. How do I think about it? We're almost out of drinks. No, I can't go to the kitchen for a second. There should be something left. Okay. Crap, how much did I drink? I can't stand up and the hallway seems to be moving. Haha. <laughs> I feel like I some see someone in the dark. As if. My skin. Where's my skin? What? I don't understand. How should I know where your skin is? You know exactly where it is. And you have to give it back to me. Until you do, I will show you things as they really are. You think it's a gift? Don't you? But very soon you understand. Take these. You need them. If I see you again and you don't have my skin, then I'll be the last thing you'll see. Good luck. <laughs> uh, and welcome, as I said, to no skin. No skin is a, uh, well, it's a rock like horror game. So... Are you ready? Don't be afraid. The golden watch is over you. So the idea is you feel, you feel, you know, you feel, uh, until you get better and that sort of stuff. Uh, these are like the left order events that can happen because I saw like Mark play this once, so. Everything seems calm. Among the faces you notice something. You pick it up and re-enter the house. Cigarettes. Nadine is waiting. What is happening, Nadine? The enemy defeated. You're in seven fragments and one lunar fragment. You're in a blood and bow. A man is hanging in the center of the room. It seems like he's still breathing. You try to scream, but from the effort you lose one HP. In the end, the man is free. You watch with an item and some fragments. Oh, that's nice. Uh. More vivid, new room unlock, kitchen, max HP pl plus one. What is the sacrificial lamp? Well, oh, it's on Dean again. Now man's cure intensifies. Long kill fished. Hello fish! Go 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 Increase the damage inflicted by melee weapons in the battle by one cumulative. The chances of escape. Oh, secrets of escape. Eh. Let's go buy the ammo. We're gonna take any demo. But thank you, fish. Alright. So many of these you cannot buy hidden anyway. They are recognized by a set of HP. In this case, they're only just survive to escape. I should join the lottery at 45%. The cult chamber. Well. Follower of the false cult. Ow. Let's go to the balcony. Cigarettes, yay! 
Is that like a starter croissant? The followers are gathering. You manage to hide before they see you. You offer a sacrifice to the false god. Remove from inventory nightshade. The offering allows you to recover half of your maximum HP. Having done that, you leave the room under the admiring aid of the faithful. Huh? That's interesting. At the center of the room, a lamp rests. You offer your blood and that of the lamp to the false god, losing 1 HP. The false god rewards you with 3 non permanent maximum HP. Oh, the hallway, probably where he resides, right? Pretty defends himself. He wants you deal in 2 damage, but the god has noticed you gush there. He should watch you with a gift. Ooh. Taking a belt is reduced by one cumulative. Tough and HP. I should have done that earlier. Oh, it's his cure. Here, face the no skin man. I don't want to face the no skin man yet. Everything seems calm. You decide to relax by taking a shower. You recover one third of your max HP. Am I like forced to face him at some point? Everything seems calm. On the ground you find a corpse covered in chrism fragments. Yeah, nice. I think I'm about to face them. Hi, Esther! Let's pray, so that becomes one. Hi, Esther. Is this like at that point? Because now I'm like at like the dead skill. Yeah, it is. You try to cross the hallway, but sometimes it's in the dark, but the potion getting closer and closer. I think that's finished pills, nice shade. Ha! Misses. I can miss? You can, you can heal? You can heal? I'm gonna win this battle, eh? Okay, not if you keep healing. I'm too good at roguelike games, I told you. I'm too good. Finally free, memory flows like a refresh because you are finally in a new area. Speak with enemy doesn't end the turn. Every time we face enemy, you might have something new to say. For the more specific situation, may lead to an unexpected conversation. I need some ammo. I want to speak. You've always been nothing but jealous. Because I'm taller, because I'm prettier. I thought you were my friend. I said you're just a snake. Inflicting bleeding. Yeah. Meet the living good, find antidote, and expect it eat. I think I want the antidote. If I can get like poison bleeding, okay. Hello. 
What do you have to say? And who the hell are you? Surely my little sister knows a lot of strange people. Yes, okay. Uh. Oh, I have five points in turns. Why does it miss? Uh, I need to use the strange pills. I need to watch out because, like, another six poison. Can I heal? Oh, I get an antidote. Uh, take a nap. Meet the deer headed man. I call traps, make deals with long pill fish. I'm still poisoned. I stole, I stole my fragment! What do you have to say? Yes. Give back my fragment. Give them back. The garage. Stealing my money. No man's curse intensifies, Kate. Hi, Mary. Deep down, I always try to keep others as far away from me as possible. I'm so jealous. I like the idea of being so special in your eyes too much. Ah, Joe Wheel, that becomes one. You know, see how I'm good at like look like this, I was not kidding. I wanna see if I can face the blood no man curse. Let's see what happens then. If I can find him. Hi Trish. Face the gnomon. Please feed the long killed fish. I need some items. Oh, thank you, fish. Go, go, go. Finally, can you hear me? I am the fish for long gills. Sometimes I say non subtle things, don't mind me. But now let's get down to business. I have some goods with me. Are you interested in anything? I am interested in anything. I don't care. I have money enough. So. Let's see if I'm gonna get him again. No. Oh. I wanna see if I'm gonna get him again. Thank you. Hello. The story here in the belt has lost a point that I believe for Stephen Drop. Oh, he must forgive me. Sometimes there's some non cynical things to remind me when I let's get down to business. So. Now I'm ready for whatever comes to me. I'm 50% way there. On the bloody mirror. Floods the bleeding mirror, he can't look away. Stop trying to stare at the minute you leave the room. I thought that was more fun. Is that where... Where 
I want to face him. Oh, find the medicate. <laughs> Good damn it, to find the medicate. I wanted to face him! Rux, Esther. Like, I'm not a nightshade, I have like two of them. Or three. Miss. I don't have any fragments! Or oh, one. Um, not another dimension, but he's not the only one. If only you could find a way to make him meet. He can heal! I said I would do 20 minutes. It's almost 20 minutes now. So. Is that the boss now? No, the, I ship it 60. Hello! Should be particularly healthy, but they still have something to offer you. Ooh. So it's fragment to end the battle as the enemy to spare you attempt to escape again. Oh, if I knew this, I would have, like, come here earlier. I assume there's a boss fight again. Corpses of that those you have killed. Well, Nightshade. Nightshade. Ha! You cannot pay to the goddess. Curses move at the end of battle. Okay. Good. You can heal four? Oh, I can. I. <laughs> you call this a boss fight? As enemy of researchers, one stay per turn doesn't end the turn. You know, I want to leave it here. Just simply because, like, it's 20 minutes. And test it in the straight. Alright, in exchange, I want some of your Christmas fractions, 20 to be exact. Sure. Then the values, don't be fooled by the numbers you see. Reflect on FD and gain so far. I don't think I'm gonna win this battle. <laughs> I'm gonna lie. She can absorb? She can absorb HP? Okay, I need to take the chance. Kill the escape, I saw text inflected bleeding. I got to 63% on my first run. I got on the good thing. Uh, if you're on the play, well, no fear. Link is at the top of the video description. Uh, as you know, this was the Reach Candy Creeps 164, if I remember from the top of my head correctly. Uh, let me double check. Yeah, 64. Uh, I'm gonna lie, this game is fun and I wanna actually continue playing. I just, as, as I tell you, I'm like, I've been playing a lot of Binding Vice games and so I've been into roguelike games, so. And the idea is now that you get stronger, because, uh... So that's the end of everything, but don't worry, I can bring you back. You just have to fulfill your mission.
Hold on. I see you're carrying lunar fragments with you. I can unlock your memories if you give me some. And remember, everything unlock here is permanent. See? See, everything you unlock here is for... So as you can see, like... You can pay this and you get like extra thing. So that make your life easier, because it's a rogue like You unlock stuff and your next one will be easier. Uh, but now break release, you're pregnant poly feed and pretend to on the internet as you can see, uh, because, uh, well, I'm still the same size belly as always. Uh, if you if you want to know what I do mainly on my channel, I primarily do horror and project different, but I also do a lot of let's plays, I highly recommend you checking my channel out. If you want to join the Patreon members that I, uh, you know, showed earlier in the video at the start, uh, make sure to check out the Patreon link in my link tree down below. Like for the only three bucks a month you get like, uh, a shout out and basically a lot of all a whole lot of goodies if you're interested make sure to check it out uh, if you want to stay up to date you can either subscribe and ring the notification bell and keep an eye on my community tab or in case you use discord you can like join my discord down to the link tree below it's my public discord in case you want to stay up to date to talk to me or anything else and if you want to play any of the games links will be at the top of the video description as i said my link tree will be at the bottom and with that i'm going to say i hope you have a wonderful night i hope you have an amazing Halloween month and my tail. See you in the next three scary games. Bye.